all of you so today i'm going to take you to a bangalore food truck festival and it is also mentioned that it's a music festival as well i'm not sure what are the dishes they are serving currently so it's for being so much let's get started event was organized at pebble pub which is quite quirky and different theme place they have bar and restaurant which is at the open space and kind of a jungle area which is really different i love that place where they were playing the music overall the place where all the trucks were available to prepare the food and serve it to the public was very very small and compact however it was decorated so well that it it was very quirky and inviting So first I took a small walk to the entire lane to check what all the food they were serving and then I bumped onto this unique concept that a barbecue bike. So they were serving all those barbecue chicken and paneer uh, with the at the counter which was quite unique theme and I really love that quirky place. disappointing part of this food festival was there was no indian food available i really wanted to eat samosa chole bhature pav bhaji but you know there are hardly any places the guy with the colorful bucket was selling that fruit wine for rupees 100 bucks which is overly priced there were almost uh, 20 counters out of that 18 counters were selling only pizza burger chicken wings etc there was no proper indian food served there was only one counter where i found they were serving some parathas but that was not at all up to the mark and one single restaurant which is uh, for the south indian food So this was the only North Indian counter which I was mentioning about who were selling some parathas pav bhajis. I thought to give it a shot to pav bhaji because that's one of my favorite dish. I thought the price was quite reasonable. However, it is total disappointment at the end and you will see why. So guys, look at the quantity they served at 120 rupees bucks. Guys, this is not at all worth the money. So this guy looks like a struggling singer who were trying to sell his voice there 
but honestly i felt pity for him uh, it was so much noisy and crowdy outside that his sound and his voice was not getting captured anywhere but he was a really a you know decent singer so this is the lounge i was talking about pebble jungle lounge and here you can see the beautiful place which made my evening totally although the overall food festival it was total disappointment for me and i will not definitely go to this food festival again next year because if you are serving us all those western food burger and pizza nobody is going to come in you should add most of the indian dishes our indian food is globally famous guys come on After spending beautiful time in the evening I have decided to end my evening with nice desert and I wanted to give it a shot to that only one place there which was Go Waffle This place totally deserve a lots of crowd and attention because the quality of the waffles with ice cream they were serving was totally totally up to the mark I loved it I hope you found this video useful. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. This desert made my evening awesome.